So hello gamers, today I'm going to be showing you the best setup for the AN-94 Assault Rifle in Phantom Forces. Now the AN-94 is a gun that I've used quite a bit. Unlike some of these starter guns like the MP412 Rex, I actually have a pretty good setup on this already. But I'll show you my setup and I'll show you some attachment options. First off, optic of preference, really anything could work here, even a Malcolm, maybe even a long range scope because this gun is very accurate. I recommend you just use like a reflex or something. For barrel, you can use a few options. Muzzle brake is good. Compensator is not really that necessary because the recoil is very low and I use muzzle booster because the recoil is just that accurate and for under barrel I would go with stubby grip and basically nothing else vertical grip if you want better hip fire maybe and maybe angled or folding but really that doesn't matter because your camera recoil is basically non-existent because your recoil is basically non-existent but if you want a little bit less recoil just in case use the stubby grip for here there's a couple things you could do first off just a laser and retracted stock is really nice I think I'm going to switch to that one actually and then for ammo type there's a few options AP is very good but super armor piercing is actually better because super armor piercing has double the penetration of normal armor piercing and triple that of the regular pen of the gun which is three studs instead of one which is quite a bit of pen you also have 762 conversion which is also pretty viable you actually get a 30 round mag now and you can actually two shot to the head which means you can one burst with the burst which is very very nice hollow point is cool i bought this for a video it gives you a three shot kill and you still keep your five shot kill at range but your damage ranges aren't that good and then tracer list is not a big deal you can use it if you have a lot of kills but don't pre-buy even with retracted stock this is actually pretty good recoil and this is pretty much the max recoil setup and the recoil is still so accurate if you just use a laser here's the recoil it's just like it's nothing you know even from longer ranges it's just like it's so accurate if you want to use retract stock you can it will make your movement better maybe i should just bite the bullet and buy super armor piercing this cost me a ton of credit so please subscribe but anyways now i have three studs of pen let's see uh Okay, damage at your damage at range doesn't change, but your damage ranges change, but it's not a big deal because this is a 4 to a 5 hit, and it does 24 min, so it basically can 4 hit all ranges. So with retracted stock, you walk really, really fast. And with this setup, you have 3 studs of pen. That is the pen of the TRG. This is one of the few guns that super armor piercing actually works on. Like the other guns, yes, you can use them on, but it doesn't really work. It just makes the gun, like, way worse. But on this one, it's like, oh my gosh. If I wanted, like, 50 less RPM, but a little bit better recoil, and by a little bit, I mean a lot, then I could just not use muzzle booster, but this is a super interesting gun. I have a lot of kills on it, but I don't really use it anymore. It was just a gun I used at one point. Okay, anyways, that's going to do it for the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.